One of the craziest things about DES is about the inventor, Sir Charles Dodds. He created DES from a chemical base, which was different than what was being used, like Primarin, which is derived from animal. This meant that it was very cheap to produce. It was also never patented. So it's easy to see why drug companies saw this as an opportunity. Within months, they were off to the races. However, Dodds was well aware that this drug was carcinogenic. He noticed that the guys in the lab that were handling the drug started to grow breasts, and he thought there could be a connection with breast cancer. There was actually a study published in 1940 that showed in rodents that the drug could produce cancer. So when Dodds found out that this drug was being marketed to prevent miscarriage, when his research had just shown that it could possibly cause miscarriage, you can see him being kind of freaked out. He actually denounced this drug to be used as a form of birth control because he felt that using foreign substances to mess with the woman's cycle was potentially dangerous. But despite all this and despite his warnings, the drug went on to usher in a whole new industry. This was the greatest experiment on women ever performed and rarely do we even hear about it, unfortunately.